Hey YouTube, this is Michael from We's Into Snakes and uh, we have our first clutch of the season. We have this girl here, which is our banana female. And she was bred to a pastel banana pie bald. So my hope with this clutch is to get a super banana um, het pied ball. So this is, like I said, this is our first clutch of the season. Let me try to get her off real easy. See how many eggs we got. And she is definitely empty. Let me try to put her over here. Yes. We'll get her uh, cleaned up. So we got two, four, six, seven eggs. So. It's a nice looking clutch. <laughs> so we'll get, uh, I have to weigh them. That's an Archie Go box. Alright, I'll grab it. But yeah, anyway, so let me, let me go ahead and take these out and I'll just set them right here for the time being. And then I can go ahead and put her back. And then I'll pull her back out, get her all cleaned up, clean her tub. So, I'll grab the scale. Okay. Okay, I'm back now. Got the got the scale, so I can go ahead and weigh these. Seven hundred eighty-two grams. So what I'll do is I'll go into my husband's repro app. Go ahead and scan her, and then I can go into here. Do reproduction. And it tells you who the sire was, number of eggs, seven viable eggs, seven fifty-six days. Total weight of eggs was what I say, seven eighty-two. And we'll candle these to make sure that they're all the right side up. She is definitely lighter. Yeah, definitely <laughs> tiny. And get her. She's 1455. Good job, girl. That's a good job. That's a good job. And that's done. So now we need to separate them. Yep. How's it feeling here? Pretty moist still. Yep. We pre-made these tubs. So that way they can be in the incubator. Nice and humid and already warmed up. And of course the longer you leave them together the more and more they're, they're sticking, but they should still pull apart fairly easily. One. Mm 
And if you feel like you're going to tear them, there would be no harm in putting the whole entire clutch the way you found it inside of the tub. We would just take this uh, hatch rack out. Definitely need to count them. I've been moving them around a bit, trying yeah. to get them separated. <laughs> Some people don't separate them they just lay them in there but I like to separate them you do it gently they usually come apart pretty easy Some of these are kind of long. Yeah. There you go. So, let me show you. This is his debut and it looks like he's in blue. He is, he's in blue. Yeah. This is the uh, sire of the clutch. Pastel banana pie ball. So. so, first, uh, well, this is actually our second clutch of the season. First clutch all went bad. So, um, but then this is, uh, I've been pretty excited about this one because I love the banana jean. I love the pies. So now we got a chance to get a female super banana head pied. So that's what I'm really hoping for. In 56 days roughly, <laughs> we'll be back here to uh, cut this clutch. We have several more. We got like 18 more pairings going right now. So um, hopefully we'll get another uh, clutch here shortly. But uh, that's it for now. We'll go back and we'll we'll candle those to make sure that we have the embryo turned to the top of the egg. Um, then uh, we'll put press and seal over top of the the container itself, and then uh, put it back in the incubator. Go ahead and get her cleaned up just to get the egg scent off of her and get the. Uh, get the tub cleaned out, put new substrate in there and everything else. That helps the female rec uh, recover faster, gets them back on food quicker so that they can get back uh, back up to weight and so forth. So, uh, sighted, first clutch of the season. Uh, stay tuned. Uh, we'll bring you some more. Hopefully, some, we'll bring you some more clutch, uh, uh, pulling clutches and uh, some egg cutting. So, thank you all for watching. We appreciate it. Please like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.